Well, friends and family came out to honor a mother and daughter today in Norfolk. Their lives were lost on Thursday. Our Tamara Scott was at the event. She has the story. Nearly 100 friends and family came out to the basketball courts right by the Croc Center in Norfolk to honor and remember Alicia and Morgan, the mother and daughter duo who I'm told had a very large impact on their community. Dear Heavenly Father, as we come this evening to remember two precious lives that were taken away from us. The basketball courts next to the Croc Center in Norfolk were filled this evening with dozens of friends, family and community members honoring 52-year-old Alicia Hereford and her daughter, 23-year-old Morgan Baysmore. Whenever something happens, you know, to one of us, it happens to all of us. The two were killed last Thursday night. They were found in Norfolk in the 800th block of Gough Street with fatal gunshot wounds. This large group tonight brought pink and purple balloons to honor their lives. Something that shouldn't, it should never happen. You know, she's 23 years old and mother's number 52 years old, you know, they haven't even lived. You know, so I just hope that, you know, we would learn from this situation. There were tears and even some celebration of life, but mostly there was pain from the brother left without a twin sister and mother and the community left without a little piece of their heart. And rest in peace, Morgan. We love you. And Miss Alicia, we love you too. But Joe Johnson says it's these times they must come together. Just, you know, like I said, it's, it's through good and bad times. When you're for the community, <laughs> whether it's a good situation or it's bad things that have a tragic. Police and the U.S. Marshals are actively looking for 27-year-old Kenyatta Jones as a suspect. While this group awaits justice, some find comfort that the mother and daughter duo had each other in their last moments. Just two great people, you know what I'm saying? And like you said, uh, I mean, like he said, you know, from the pictures, they're always together. And then for to go out together, that's touching. Now, Norfolk police are still investigating this incident. If you know anything, you're asked to call the crime line or police. We'll keep you updated with the latest information on air and online at wavy.com. For now in Norfolk, Tamara Scott, 10 on your side.